let's see how to make a playable game in just five minutes this game. You can use the arrow keys to move the ball to get to the platform's other side. Now there's full physics and momentum and collisions where you can fall off, as you can see I'm doing on purpose here. How do we do this? We make it using the free playcanvas.com. Now before we see the simple game, let's see what a little more complicated game can look like. This was built in 12 hours using a hackathon, using Play Canvas, and it's a multiplayer uh, tank game where you just go and try to shoot everyone who is not in your, on your team. <laughs> and there I got one guy. So the whole point of the game is to just use the walls to your advantage and try not to get shot. I'm doing pretty good. You can also repair your tank here and there's power-ups in different areas of the map. So it's pretty cool. Okay, so how do we do this? Well, let's sign up for an account and you can do this with me. I'm just going to use my Google account to sign in. I just discovered this site a few days ago when I was looking for different tools we can use to make our game. Didn't know we're designing a game? Click that eye up there. That'll take you to the video where I've asked your feedback, Freedom Family, on what kind of game we should make. So let's take a look at this particular game. Now, it's a very simple guided tutorial. It's telling you to click on things, duplicate that, uh, that block, move it into position where you can do it very carefully using all of these controls and once you have it good enough you can publish the game and when you publish the game you can get a link that everyone you want to share the game with can use so I just clicked launch and it's going to load the game this is all browser based you don't need flash or any kind of other uh, add-on now if I want to actually share this with my friends, then I would need to click on my first project and then publish the game with a link right here. So I click publish and there are no apps. Oh, did I forget to save it? Let me see. I may have not saved it. Well, you get the idea guys. I'm not going to spend time going over all of these details, but try this tool if you're interested in making a game. Send us links to your games that you make in the description, in the comments beneath this video. And I will feature what I think are the most exciting and interesting games in the next video. With this episode, I also want to talk about yesterday's episode we asked you to share your YouTube story in the Freedom Dashboard. It turns out that a thousand of you have now done that. So for those of you who haven't yet, simply go to the Freedom Dashboard. Now I'm signed in as an administrator here so this is not helpful. This is what you would see. And then go to your YouTube story. Type in your YouTube story here, and then you can see other people's YouTube stories down here. Now, here's an example of, well, this is not in English, so I can't read that. Here's an example of a YouTube story by Gaming Cap'n that said, I started YouTube when I was 10, and I need more views and subs, but I got that when I got freedom. Thank you. So you're welcome, Gaming Cap'n. Let's read another story. Now these are completely random. I have no idea what's going to come up every time I click that button. I started YouTube a year ago. It has been an up and down experience. Negative comments and many positive ones. Everyone experiences it, but you have to rise above the hate. Very, very true, amazing potato gaming. So one thing we're going to do in, in the edit mode here is you're going to be able to input your name as well as a link to where you want people to go if they click your name. So it could be your YouTube channel, it could be your website, it could be your Facebook page. When we add that feature, all of your stories here will make your name clickable. And Amazing Potato Gaming, if I click that, would go to presumably his YouTube channel, but it could go to something else about him. So we will add that feature. What else should we add to this your YouTube story feature. You already suggested a like button as well as 
a view count to see how many times people have viewed your story. What else should we add? Tell us in the comments below. And I also want to update everyone on a big milestone. Freedom is about to cross 150 million subscribers. Look at this number. We're currently at 100, I'll zoom in here. We're currently at 149,877,559 subscribers in the Freedom family. And we're about to cross 150 million. That's amazing, guys. 150 million people have subscribed to the channels that you have partnered with Freedom. I can't tell you how proud I am. We also have 30 billion views. And can you tell me what happens when we reach 100 billion? We give away a car. Didn't know we we're going to do that? Click that eye up there. That'll take you to the 100 billion contest where if you guess the day that we cross 100 billion views first, then you will win a $20,000 car. I think that's going to be quite an amazing uh, time, video, episode, everything when it happens. So we're 30% of the way there at 30 billion views. Well done, Freedom Family. Any other big updates I can share with you? Well, there is one that I want to share a teaser with you. Ever, have you ever been to dashboard.tm? www.dashboard.tm? Well, we are now building this as a general daily motion dashboard that will include YouTube and other things. But right now, what it lets you do is it lets you create your daily motion channel and synchronize all of your videos from your YouTube channel to your shiny new daily motion channel with a scheduler that will let you upload videos once a day so you don't flood your new daily motion channel subscriber count. Here's how it works. Simply sign in with YouTube once you go to dashboard.tm then you will be prompted to sign in to daily motion and if you don't have an account yet you can create one and then it'll simply start transferring videos one at a time that you select either everything or just the ones you want so for example I've already uploaded these three videos but I can upload more or I can just select all and then I can schedule the interval where I'll hide myself here where you can choose how often you want videos to be published. Right now I've chosen once a day or every day, but I can just choose every three days or every two days. And then you can see each day when each video that you've selected will go live on your Daily Motion channel. This helps you get more money on Daily Motion. This helps you grow your audience faster because you're getting people watching you on both platforms, YouTube and Dailymotion. And I think this is pretty cool. What do you think of this new dashboard.tm, which is just, just getting started? This is not going to be only for Dailymotion. Believe me, dashboard.tm has a lot of new features that will be helping everybody grow. It's the dashboard for everyone. Do you have to be partnered by Freedom to use it? No! That's why it's the dashboard for everyone. Literally, everyone can use the tool to synchronize their YouTube channel to their Daily Motion channel using our dashboard.tm. And there's going to be a lot more tools coming that'll apply to all people. Once again, thank you for the almost 150 million subscribers in the Freedom family. We're going to keep growing to a billion subscribers and on, I am sure. So let's keep growing together as a family. And who am I? I am George, CEO and founder of Freedom. And you've been watching. And we will grow together as a family because this is the Freedom family. You are part of it. We are all part of it. And we're all growing together. So grow with us and partner with Freedom. That play now button 
right there on the video bar is all you need to click to get started.